This is Ian Cameron for Sportsbook Review with your NHL play of the day for Friday, February the 10th. Uh, Ready to get at it. Just two games on the slate today. We're going to do something a little bit different. A different kind of bet. A different kind of wager on tonight's NHL card. Uh, And we're going to get into it right now. We are going to look in a different direction. Usually when I'm on doing play of the day, I'm doing a side recommendation or a totals recommendation on one game. We're going to encapsulate both games on the NHL slate tonight, and what I'm going to recommend is a bet on what is called the Grand Salami. I'm sure some of you, some of you might be looking at me right now as I'm saying that, saying, what the hell are you talking about, Ian? Isn't this a sports betting video? It's not some delicatessen review here or something like that. No, 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 no. Not that kind of salami, all right? Not the one you eat. I'm talking about the Grand Salami. Now, what the Grand Salami is in the NHL It is a wager that is offered at pretty much all the major books. I mean, Pinnacle, Bookmaker, Five Dimes, go on down the list. They all offer this kind of uh, bet. The Grand Salami in the NHL is basically you bet on the number of total goals to be scored in all the games taking place that day combined. So all the games on the schedule, for instance, today, just two games, but you get to bet over under number of goals scored in all those games combined, you get to do the same thing for Saturday's card. Saturday is a loaded card. You know, there's a bunch of games. I think 10 plus games on Saturday's schedule. You can do the same thing with Saturday. Over, under, number of total goals in all the games combined. That is called the Grand Salami. Uh, and it's usually a bet that I don't often make uh, because you get some of these situations, especially on a day like Saturday where there's 10 games, you might like the over. And you might have a few, a lot of games that are higher scoring, but if you get just one, two, or God forbid, three of these games that end up one nothing, two to one, two nothing, it can just ruin your entire bet with the over Grand Salami. So you got to be selective, got to be conservative, got to pick your spots when you bet the Grand Salami wagering option in the National Hockey League. I think we have a good opportunity with the Grand Salami with the two isolated games taking place on this Friday night uh, NHL card. You've got the Tampa Bay Lightning taking on the Minnesota Wild in one game, Chicago Blackhawks taking on the Winnipeg Jets in the other game. And with three of the four teams involved in these two games tonight, you have three of the four teams in the NHL that right now, in terms of current form, They are the strongest trending over the total teams in the league right now by far. And really, it's not even close. You have the Minnesota Wild on an unbelievable 23-3 over the total streak in their last 26 games. That's 20 overs, 3 unders, and 3 pushes for the Minnesota Wild in their last 26 games. It has been one of the strongest, longest-running total streaks I've ever seen in my over a decade of betting NHL hockey. It's unreal. The Minnesota Wild have been going over the total as often as they have. In the Chicago-Winnipeg game, you have a Chicago team that has gone 6-1 and one to the over in their last seven games. You have a Winnipeg Jets team that has gone 15-3-1 and one to the over uh, in their last uh, 19 games. So it's just a remarkable run for of overs involving three of these four teams. And even Tampa Bay is a team that can score and has also struggled a bit defensively uh, at times. They're definitely uh, no under team by any stretch of the imagination. So you have four teams right now where the projections are we should see goals in both of these games tonight involving these four teams. Uh, the Minnesota overrun. Uh, in that game against Tampa Bay, by the way, Tampa Bay gets two key forwards back. Should help them offensively. Uh, Alex Kalorn. Andre Palat, both returning from injury uh, for this game tonight for Tampa Bay. So that should help them offensively. Uh, And in the Chicago-Winnipeg game, I mean, you've got both teams, Chicago and Winnipeg, right now in their last 10 games, both of them, they're averaging three or more goals scored per game. They're giving up three or more goals per game. So you've got situations where... We should see offense. We should see goals in bunches. But instead of just looking at the individual game totals over, we're going to look at the Grand Salami total for these two games tonight. The Grand Salami total, again, the number of total goals in the two games combined, the total is 10.5, minus 130. You can find that at, again, pretty much every major offshore sports book gives you the option of betting the NHL Grand Salami. The total 10.5 for these two games, minus 130 to the over. That's what we're going to look at. 
Now, what I like about the Grand Salami is we could have we could be off on one of these games. Let's say the uh, Chicago Winnipeg game maybe not as higher scoring. We only get you know four goals in that game uh, instead of, of you know six or more, which would have put it over the total. Maybe we only get a three-one game in Chicago Winnipeg. That doesn't kill us with the Grand Salami. We could get an absolute outburst in the Tampa Minnesota game. We could get a 4-3 game, a 5-4 game. We could see seven goals or nine goals in that Tampa Minnesota game. And even if we get seven or nine in that game and we only get four in the uh, Chicago Winnipeg game, we still cash the uh, Grand Salami over because the combined total would go over that 10 and a half. So that's the beauty and that's the good thing I guess that's the positive of the grand salami option you could be off on one of your games it doesn't completely ruin your bet it doesn't mean you're out the only thing that would hurt us tonight with the grand salami is that if both games stay under the total because if both games stay under the total that means both games aren't reaching more than five total goals scored and if that's the case it's not getting over ten and a half with the grand salami but again we could be off in terms of the projection of total goals in one of these games, it may not necessarily kill the Grand Salami uh, bet for us here uh, on tonight's Friday NHL card. So let's make it official. I think we get goals in both of these games, and we get enough goals in the two games combined between Tampa, Minnesota, and Chicago, Winnipeg to cash this Grand Salami up and over the total. So let's make it official. I'm going to recommend the NHL Grand Salami over 10.5 minus 130. That's rotation number 91. The Grand Salami over 10.5 goals minus 130 to have 10.5 to have 11 or more goals scored rather in the two games combined tonight on this Friday NHL card, the Tampa Minnesota game and the Chicago Winnipeg game. I think both of those games we get 11 or more goals combined in those two games. Grand Salami over 10.5. That is going to be the play of the day for NHL action on Friday, February the 10th. All right, that'll wrap it up. I am Ian Cameron for Sportsbook Review. Until next time, enjoy the games and good luck. Research before you bet. Be sure to check out SPR Picks for the best game predictions, breakdowns, and much, much more.